Welcome back friends to Miss J's class. Today we are going to read a story called The Color of Us by Karen Katz. Karen Katz wrote the book, so she is the author. Good job. So in The Color of Us, we're going to talk about how everybody looks a little bit different and how that's a good thing. How boring would it be if we all look the same? You can see on the cover, everyone's skin is a little bit different color. What color is Miss J's skin? Some people would say white. But I don't think I'm this color. Or I don't think I'm this color. I think there are so many different colors of us. These are my people crayons. Look how many different shades you could be. I think I'm more of a peach. Which crayon do you think looks like your skin? Let's see what the colors of us is about. All the different hands, all the different skin colors. To all the kids in the world, especially my beautiful daughter, Lena, and to my mom for believing the artist in me. Special thanks to Laura. Sometimes in the beginning of the book, the author sends a special note out to their friends and family. The Colors of Us. My name is Lena and I am seven. I am the color of cinnamon. Mom says she could eat me up. So she said the skin color is cinnamon. You guys ever had cinnamon before? It's kind of sweet, kind of spicy. My mom's the color of French toast. She's an artist. Mom's teaching me how to mix colors. She says that if I mix red, yellow, black, and white paints in the right combination, I will have the right brown for a picture of me. The right brown? But mom, brown is brown, I say. That's not so, mom says. There are lots of different shades of brown. Let's take a walk, you'll see. Look at all those different shades of brown on the shelf. It says pan, cocoa, sand, toast, Okra, chocolate, sienna, brown, so many different kinds of brown. Did you know there was more than one kind of brown? We go to the playground where we see my friend Sonia. Sonia is a light yellow brown, mom says. Just like creamy peanut butter, I say. My favorite. So Miss J and Sonia have different skin colors. Is that okay? Of course. Isabella is chocolate brown, like the cupcakes we had for her birthday. So, Isabella is a brown skin. Lucy has skin that's peachy and tan. So, Lucy has skin kind of like Miss J. My friend Jo Jin lives close to the playground. Jo Jin is the color of honey. Two streets over, we meet my cousin Kyle. His skin is a reddish brown, like leaves in the fall. Carlos and Rosita have brought their new puppy to the park. Carlos is a light cocoa brown, and Rosita's skin looks like butterscotch. When we pass by the pizza parlor, Mom and I see Mr. Pellegrino flipping a pizza high in the air. He is the color of a pizza crust, a golden brown. My babysitter, Candy, is like a beautiful jewel, bronze and amber. She looks like a princess. How beautiful. Mom and I walk to the park to eat lunch. Look at everyone's legs. Mom, all the different shades. So some of us have light skin, some of us are peachy, some they describe as cinnamon or French toast, or what did they describe that last one as? The babysitter is a beautiful bronze and amber. Look at all those. After lunch, we walk to mom's favorite store where Mr. Kashmir sells many different spices. He's the color of ginger and chili powder. Up the street is my Aunt Kathy's laundromat. Aunt Kathy is tawny tan like coconuts and coffee toffee.
After our walk, my friends come over. We take our towels to the roof and lie in the sun. I think about everyone I saw today. Sonia, Isabella, and Lucy, Jojin and Kyle, Carlos and Rosita, Mr. Pellegrino and Candy, Mr. Kashmir and Aunt Kathy. Each one of them is a beautiful color. She's laying with all of her friends and they all have different colors. They're all beautiful. My friends leave and I go downstairs. I am happy as I get out my paint. Yellow, red, black, and white. I think about all the wonderful colors I will make and I say their names out loud. Cinnamon, chocolate, and honey. Coffee, coffee, and butterscotch. They sound so delicious. I like how she's picking names for all of our different things, like yummy foods. At last, my pictures are done and I've painted everyone. Look, Mom, I say, the colors of us. Everyone is a different color. We don't all have the same color. Some of us are beautiful, beautiful. The and let's see, I want to see what color we think our skin is. Do you guys think you were a cinnamon or a coffee or a coffee? Which one do you think was the most beautiful? Sometimes in a pack of crayons, we only have peach or brown, and we're not only those colors. So I think it's really important that we get people colored crayons, and we can use all these different shades. Thank you guys so much for reading The Colors of Us with me by Karen Katz. See you next time, friends.